Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am back again with another ASMR mukbang eating show and I have a special treat. I have keto friendly chocolate mousse. Look at this, you guys. Look at that chocolate mousse. So this is like the simplest thing to make. I use my magic bullet and I pour about a cup of heavy cream and then I just let it mix and mix and mix and mix until you hear that it turns into like soft peaks okay you pour you pour it into a bowl okay it's gonna get thick it's gonna create soft peaks in that bowl you add a little packet of stevia i use liquid stevia it's even better because it's zero carbs you put a little capful of vanilla extract and about a teaspoon or a tablespoon depending you know i always add little by little because i don't like it too strong of uh, the unsweetened uh cocoa powder which is like the hershey's brand or whatever and i just get a whisk you know like the one you use to beat your eggs and i just mix it all in a bowl and i keep mixing 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 until it turns into a thick chocolate mousse you guys this is so delicious now this is a treat for once in a while because it is higher fat and you shouldn't have it every day <laughs> but it's so good you guys look at that i put some whipped cream on top mm. oh my god you guys i have made this dessert so many times for my friends because when we have dinners at my house you know and i always keep it keto friendly i have made this before for my friends and they've tried it out and they're like oh my god this is so good are you sure this is keto and i'm like yep 100 <laughs> percent and um it's funny because one of my friends my friend vicky the first time she tried it she loved it so now every time she comes over she's like oh my god can you make me some of your chocolate mousse she was like I'm so addicted to it. She was like, you have to give me the, the recipe. <laughs> mm. yeah. It's so good, you guys. So one of these days, I'll make a cooking video. And I'll show you guys how I make it. But like I said, it's super simple. And if you have one of those hand mixers or... um. What do you call those? Not a food processor, but you know, the ones that mix like batter up, like if you're trying to make like a cake batter or something. But I don't have one of those, so I have to do it by hand. But like I said, it's super simple to make. I make it in like three minutes, it's done. Very, very simple to make. And I love my magic bullet because i just pour my heavy cream in there and i just like let it stir and mix and mix until i hear that the bullet the noise is different it doesn't sound so much like a liquid anymore but it kind of sounds like the blender is struggling to you know and you could just tell by the sound it makes when the heavy cream has already turned into soft peaks it's awesome And then like I said, I just mix everything in a bowl and I do it all by hand. It's super easy. Mm. Look at that. Yummy. I wish it would focus more, but yeah. <laughs> mm. So yeah, but like I said, you guys, this is a treat. <laughs> Okay, this is not something you should eat every day because even though it's your healthy fat right here, heavy cream, it is higher calories, so you have to be careful. <laughs> Once in a while is okay. And honestly, I don't think I'm going to eat the entire cup. I think I'm just going to eat maybe like half a cup and I'm going to save the other half for David because he loves my chocolate mousse as well. But... I wanted to share this treat with you guys because I've never, 
I've never really told you guys about my keto friendly chocolate mousse and it's so good look at that now that the whipped cream is going low mm. see how it comes out it comes out perfect exactly the texture of a chocolate mousse I never thought that was possible to do and I had gotten a while back right because I was trying to like go on before I made my own you know chocolate mousse I was going on Pinterest and like keto channels to see how they did it you know to get ideas and there was this channel I believe it was keto connect they put mascarpone cheese on their um chocolate mousse I tried it that way one time and I did not like it it, it tasted weird like cheese on on chocolate like I don't know it was weird so yeah I didn't like it so I came up with my own I just whipped it up I used my head <laughs> I thought of you know keto friendly ingredients that I could add to my chocolate mousse so I started experimenting with it and then I realized that yeah man if I just stick my heavy cream inside my bullet mixer and I let it mix in there really good it's gonna get thick so once it creates that soft peaks then you throw it in the bowl you put all the stuff you know the, the, the cocoa powder remember it has to be unsweetened and unsweetened cocoa powder is very bitter so <laughs> please make sure to use stevia or sweetener erythritol monk fruit whatever sweetener you use that is keto friendly you put it in there you put a little cap full of um you know vanilla extract and that's it you get your bowl you get your your whisk and you just mix the crap out of it until it turns into this consistency of a chocolate mousse you guys oh. so easy to make mm. okay i am down to my last bite because i'm getting full it does fill you up fast so you don't have to make a full cup. I think a serving, a good serving size would be half a cup. But like I said, I made a full cup because I know how much David loves this. David started back up on keto. He had left keto for a while. He was taking a break. It was just becoming harder for him to do it since he works and everything. And he's, you know, he burned so much energy and he just like, whatever. <laughs> he lost his track with keto, but he recently got back on it so i'm making more recipes and stuff like that for him and keto friendly meals so when i low i know how much he loves my chocolate mousse so we don't each have to have an entire full cup half a cup is more than enough for a serving because it does fill you up and like i said it's pretty fatty it's healthy fat but <laughs> if you're still trying to lose weight you want to cut down on that fat you know there we go that's it i am done i'm super full i'm gonna save that half for david and then he could just put some of his whipped cream on top and it's delicious i hope you guys try this recipe i hope you like it i will link it below uh the instructions in my description box but like i said um stay tuned for more because i am gonna make a cooking video showing you guys how i make my keto friendly chocolate mousse so i will see you on my next video if you guys are new to my channel please don't forget to like and subscribe hit that notification bell and click on the description box below for a link to all my social media and i will see you all in my next video all right guys bye bye